My whole career has been about helping people and serving other people's success, helping organizations. So I love music. I mean, who doesn't love music? So why not use music to help root your company to success? The guitar is what I use to create the background music and the participants uh, in the workshop, they're the ones that come up with the lyrics, the title, all the things, and then we put it all together and we make it into an amazing song. Uh, this workshop brings people out of their shell, gets people to bond something they take away from the workshop to help them be even more aligned with the company's values, mission, and purpose. Welcome to Dream Big with Big Dreamers, conversations for career growth, inspiration, and insight. It's time to dream big. I'm excited to welcome Carlton Butts, a renowned speaker, consultant, and executive coach. Carlton has an impressive background as a NASA intern, international consultant, IP and entertainment attorney, and tech CEO. His expertise has shaped transformative strategies for leaders around the world. We're here to discuss Carlton's innovative workshop, Harmonizing Values, Mission, and Purpose, which uses musical themes to revolutionize corporate training. With studies from Gallup and McKinsey showing that many employees feel disengaged from their company, Carlton's unique approach is crucial for organizations looking to thrive in today's dynamic market. Carlton, thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you so much for having me. And by the way, that was an amazing introduction. So uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, it sounds well. I'm sorry. I really appreciate that. But I'm very glad to be here. Thanks, Donna. Well, my, my pleasure. And you know, you're really providing something really unique, something very, very different. So what, what got you into doing this? Well, I'll tell you, my whole career has been about helping people and serving other people's success, helping organizations. You know, when I first graduated college, you know, my job was with Booz Allen and Hamilton as a consultant. And I really got exposed to helping organizations with strategy, helping them improve performance and operations, and I really enjoy that. The engagement with clients to helping them serve their needs was amazing. And as an attorney, I really was able to further that. You know, I'm able to help people with legal challenges and legal issues, things that are impacting their business. So, you know, the fulfillment you get when you can help people solve an issue and get them over a challenge is powerful, and I loved it. And so I became an advisor and coach you know, really after being approached by friends that work at big companies or law firms and they had certain issues and challenges and say, hey, could you help me with this? And everything from retention, time management, burnout, communication, feedback, collaborative leadership, it really doesn't matter what it is. It was in my DNA to try to help people and serve their success. So I started doing that. And that was the genesis of Matter Tree, my uh, consulting and coaching company. And I really love it. So that's what got me into this area. There's one piece here that you're not talking about, and that's what's really driving what you're doing now, which is you're taking your corporate background, your, your knowledge of business and law and people, and you're combining it with your love of music. Absolutely. So I love music. I mean, who doesn't love music? I mean, we all love music. But I started playing guitar at a young age, and it really transformed my life. I got deeper into music. I got deeper into uh, everything that music stands for. And I've learned the power of music over the years. I was walking through the supermarket the other day. I heard a song over the loudspeaker, and it brought me back to a moment in time when I was hanging out with my friends in college. That's what music can do. It can really define moments in our lives. And we all relate to music in so many different ways. And Music really adds a lot of value, uh, not just, you know, enjoying it and listening to it, but it allows you to retain information. You know, one of the biggest, I think, benefits of music is allow, you know, when you hear something like a jingle, for example, K Jewelers or State Farm, they have jingles to get you to hum or sing their brand or their remind you of their services and what they have to offer. So music is really powerful in that way. You know, the other thing is motivation. When we go to the gym, when we go to work out, what do we do? We listen to music. And it not only gets you energized and motivated, but it also can soothe you and can relieve stress. It helps us through our you know, best of times and it can help us through our worst of times. So music is really a great vehicle for that. And lastly, it's something that helps people with cultural identity. A lot of times when I go off, I wear like a certain shirt, like an Ivana shirt or something. Somebody else will walk up who's also a fan and you can meet people because you are identifying with the same song, the same music, same uh, band, whatever it might be. And it resonates with people. So 
a, a great example of that is when we were younger, we learned a national anthem. One of the first songs we all learned. And that really is what defines our cultural identity. You know, it gives you a sense of pride and purpose, brings people together for a common mission, all under the banner of your country. And it's 193 countries around the world have uh, anthems, and, and it's really a powerful way to convey a message. Lastly, I'll just say, being a sports fan, college football is coming up. I've been in those stadiums on Saturdays where everybody's singing the fight song. You know, one song from the school, everybody, tens of thousands of people from all walks of life, they're all sitting there singing a song. And the goal of that is to root their team to victory. So why not use music to help root your company to success? Absolutely. So tell me about this workshop, because to me, everything that you just said, it feeds in so beautifully to companies' needs for their employees to understand their values, to understand the mission, to understand their commitment to making that difference. So tell me a little bit more about this workshop and how it works. Absolutely. So the goal of the workshop is really to get employees and business leaders to know your mission, understand your purpose and to live your values. That's the really important thing. And so we start out by going over the values and mission and purpose of the company. It's a deeper dive, not only knowing what they are, but being able to apply them to what you do at work, to be able to understand on a deeper level how you treat other colleagues or how you interact with clients or customers. And so it really allows you to get a deeper understanding of what they are. And then we go on a creative journey to create even a more immersed experience using music. And it's a creative way not only to, to get a better understanding of the values and mission and purpose of your company, but also gives you an opportunity to bond with other members of your team. And the fun part of all this is you get to find out who in your company can actually sing. So it's, <laughs> it makes it really interesting as well on that level. Speaking of singing, you have a guitar there and you I are do. a longtime guitarist. So how do you weave the guitar into this workshop? One of the things that songwriters do is they write songs to their fan base. They know their audience. So if you're a country music artist, you write songs to your fans who love country music. If you're an R&B artist or an alternative, whatever genre of music, you write those songs to appeal to your fan base. And so one of the things we do in the workshop is to figure out what genre of music really represents your company and how you want that represented. It's knowing the audience. Is the audience your customers? Is it your clients? Is it the employees in the company? And so we explore those based on the mission, the value, and purpose. And we understand what area, what genre it applies to, and then what type of song do you want? You want a happy song? You want a slow song? There's a lot of different ways to do it. So with guitar, we can come up with something that's a little more upbeat, something like this. Get people, get people going. You can do something a little slower. You can do different genres, maybe people like jazz. We go by the energy in the room. No song is the same. Every group's going to do it differently. And you really feed off the energy and the creativity of the people that are in that room at that time. So we have fun with it. Whether they want to do country, R&B, rock, mm -hmm. alternative, we create songs using the genre. The guitar is what I use to create the background music. And the participants uh, in the workshop, they're the ones that come up with the lyrics, the title, all the things, and then we put it all together and we make it into an amazing song uh, that is memorable, that is fun, that is engaging, something they can take away from the workshop to help them be even more aligned with the company's values, mission, and purpose. And this is something that is really important. Most employees do feel that they, they are not in tune to, to use a word that works well with your workshop, <laughs> to those things. But what happens? So they do this, and they, they experience it. They have a better understanding, a better sense. What, what can they expect afterwards because they now have internalized this? That's a great question, and really there's a variety of benefits from this. So the first thing is understanding your values, mission, and purpose. So if you look back, we'd mentioned earlier about Gallup and uh, McKinsey. Gallup had a poll that basically said only 23% of, of workers can you know, strongly agree that they can apply their company's values at work, only 23%. According to Deloitte, 21%, only 21% could actually identify their company's mission statement. And McKinsey had a study that said 70% of the people that they surveyed actually have a sense of purpose based on where they work. So it shows you that this matters to your employees. And Gallup had another poll where they basically found that highly engaged workforces um, are 21% more profitable. So if you're a company that has 100 million in profits a year, you can actually get another 21 million in profits 
if your employees are even more highly engaged. So this workshop yeah. allows them to do that and it really brings them together. So that's the first thing. The second thing is team building collaboration. It really gives them an, idea, an opportunity to work together as a team, to be creative with others. I always say one of the best ways to get your employees engaged is to get to know who they are what their aspirations are, what they like to do. This workshop brings that out. It, it brings people out of their shell, gets people to, to sort of bond through music, which is one of the best ways, as we discussed earlier, to get people together, to have a nice moment in time. And the other thing is identity. It gives them an identity with the firm. It allows them to align their personal goals and objectives to what the company's goals and objectives are as well, which is also very important as far as engagement. Well, there's places that I've worked where there, there really isn't any emphasis on values or mission or purpose. So you really, even though you do your job, you really don't know what the greater purpose of that job is. How does this job really affect the company? How does this job, what I do affect the customers? And I think knowing that through this workshop really gives you a deeper understanding as the purpose of what you do and why it's important with what you do. And the, the other thing is morale. This is a great morale booster. It's uh, I think a lot of cultures, everyone's working hard with the pandemic was very difficult, but what a great way to boost morale for your company, get them energized, get them engaged. It's pretty cool. This workshop really allows people to do that and gets companies to that highly engaged workforce that Gallup was talking about, where not only does it increase profitability, but it also gives people uh, a purpose and a sense of uh, camaraderie with their colleagues. So it's a great workshop to really bring all that together. I keep thinking of those who are millennials and the, the Gen Z coming up. When you talk to them, they, they want to feel fulfilled. They want to feel that their work matters. And what a fabulous and fun way of, of bringing it all together. So it, let's say someone is listening and they want to they wanna take that first step. What, what would you suggest? What, what are things that they should be thinking about and how can they get started with you? Well, the, the best way is to reach out to me. You can reach out to me either through LinkedIn, Carlton Butts. You can reach out uh, via email. My name is Carlton, K-A-R-L-T-O-N, at mattertree.com. That's the word matter, the word, the word tree, all one word, dot com. And really, it starts out with a 15 to 30 minute conversation to find out what the company's needs are and really what their desired results are. You know, this workshop could work great for a global executive team, for example, that's having a retreat and they want to revisit their values, mission and purpose. So it's a way to bring them all together, to have a fun time where the executives could really have a deeper dive in, into their values, mission and purpose and then have a fun exercise where they can create a, a cool song they can all listen to. It's a great way to kick off uh, a retreat. Definitely it gets them energized, motivated. And now they have a sense of pride with their company. So it's pretty cool. The other advantage of this workshop is really for new hires. You know, how cool it would be if you had, as people are coming into your company, they know your mission's value and purpose day one. They know exactly why they're there. They know their mission. They uh, understand the purpose of why they're there and they will live the values. They know what values uh, are set forth by the company. So they know day one how to treat other people, how to treat customers, how to make certain decisions that align with those values and mission and purpose. So this is another powerful tool for companies to get people on board quickly and to get them aligned quickly and engaged quickly. So it's a great opportunity for them to do that. But yeah, I'm more than happy to talk with anyone who's interested. I have fun with this. We're gonna have a great time in this session. Music's my passion. I love to bring that out in the workshop and really get people engaged. So I'm looking forward to, to working with, with anyone who has an interest in bringing this workshop to their, their organization. Well, Carlton, this is this is fabulous. It's unique. It's different. It's fun. It's memorable, and it, it brings everyone together. I, I think it's a it's a wonderful opportunity. Can you play a song right before I end this podcast? <laughs> <laughs> well, I didn't have a song ready to play for the podcast, but I mean, I can I can play a little music. I'll play a little song uh, just to get us going uh, out of this. Now we just have to imagine the mission of your company, the mission statement of your company. <laughs> exactly. Carlton, thank you so much. I really appreciate sure. this. Absolutely. I had a great time, Donna. Thank you so much for having me on your podcast. And I look forward to meeting you out there. So please reach out. Thank you.